We're here on this Roballo R302 and it's powered by twin Yamaha F300s. What we're doing is we're testing a new propeller from Shero Marine. It's called the MX3 and it's really innovative and it boosts your speed, your efficiency, your handling. And we're gonna prove that by putting them head to head versus traditional propellers. The benefit of doing this side-by-side -side comparison is we get to test both sets of propellers in the exact same conditions. Same fuel load on the boat, crew weight, wind speed, same current speed, everything was identical. We took two traditional 15 by 19 inch, three-bladed stainless steel propellers, and we did all the performance data, and then we also put it through performance tests. How does it feel when you do a hard turn at 30 miles per hour? How does it feel when you're handling around the dock or in close quarters? How does it feel when you're doing S-curves and cruising? Then we put the Shero MX-3s on, we put the boat through the same test, and we compared the results. Head to head, the Shero props help the boat climb onto plane almost a second faster. With the Shero props, the boat hit 30 miles per hour almost a half second quicker, but what you can't see is how much smoother it was to get to 30 miles per hour. Top speed was nearly identical for both sets of propellers, and it felt safer to turn at top end than it would with the traditional props. At 3,000 RPM, you can see the most obvious advantage for the Shero propellers. With the Sharos, the boat is cruising along at 27.1 miles per hour, while with the traditional props, it's struggling to climb onto plane at 14.3 miles per hour. At this RPM, the Shero propellers also proved five decibels quieter than the traditional propellers, which is a huge number. With the Shero propellers, the boat can hold plane at 2,700 RPM. So after testing both sets of props, I came away really impressed with the Shero Marine propellers. They did everything the company says they're gonna do. They helped with efficiency, close quarters handling, they were quieter. To me, the sweet spot for the Shero props was around 3,000 RPM. The boat really came to life to the tune of 10 miles per hour faster than with the traditional props at the same RPM. They really have an advantage over traditional props. Low end to top speed, you just feel more connected to the water. I'm really impressed. I think you'll like them too. You should check them out.